deep third as two players out. Matthews in the air and dropped first ball. Just wasn't ready for it there. Full straight and punch down the ground. That's a beautiful shot from George Redmayne. It's a great outfield as well. That's going to be four up onto the velodrome part of Hurstville Oval. Square leg in front of square on the leg side. Straight in the air, one hand to catch. What a beauty! Sarah Ellie didn't even know it stuck herself. That's a beautiful catch. And it's been swung away to the leg side. Really nicely timed. One bounce. Been safe. Is it high and long? Is it going to carry? It is. Oh, and almost a fantastic catch. It's gone into the boundary. Back. Two back on the square leg boundary. And there's one there. Gone. First ball. So Van Nika drops one first ball in fielding. Takes one first ball with ball in hand. We're in place now. Anna catching mid-wicket. Huge appeal. Almost pleading with the umpire there. The changes. Down the wicket and smashes it straight. Have a look at that shot. One bounce, two, and into the rope. What a good shot. Those clean hitters of the ball. And there's a good example there, but is it going to be far enough? Coming around on the deep wicket boundary, it's gone over. That help her hit her straps. Moves to 21. And now sweeps and sweeps well, and that's going to be four more. Back to back boundaries. Well played, Matthews. He's now set. Hits that in the air. It's going to be wide of long off, is it? No, it's going to be caught. A lot of ground to cover there. That's really good fielding. It was hit in the air. It was more placed than it was hit firmly. Hurstville. Bold. Ali takes her third. Tried to work to the leg side. Came off the top of the pad and onto the stumps. Sarah Ali, the destroyer here for the Sydney Sixers. That one's short and it's pulled away. It's going to be one bounce into the fence for four. And gone. Healy takes the bails off. And Nika gets her second wicket. Well bowled. Tosses it up. Encouraged all to come down the crease. Last ball, the 19th over. Backs away and is knocked over. Mary Zag Cap gets her first wicket with her last ball. Joyce gone for 24. Try and get it so she can't get in and under it. Which she does right there. It's gone right down the throat of deep square leg. And it's gone. Another catch. Another good outfield catch to the Sixers. Big smile on the face. Probably more relief than anything. Two balls remaining now. Full and straight hit on the toe. A huge appeal. Can't believe it's given not out. Going to come back for a second. Oh, and a direct hit would have had a wicket. It is leg buys. It's full and it's hit. Not too much conviction into the offside. Phillips says one. She's going to come back for a second with the why not approach. And it's going to be run out. So one more run to the total. Eight for 106. Matthews, Knight, Joyce. We've got a few. Burns as well. That's in the air and that's gone. Hunter takes a wicket with the fourth ball of the innings. Healy, a bit of a lazy shot there. Just flicked it onto the onside. And then we've got people who don't have any chocolate when it's hot. That's a great shot. Gardner, not standing on ceremony there. One bounce. A lot of interest in this game. It's in the air and that's going to go for four. What a good shot. Gardner was just slightly over pitched from Pike. Pike over pitches again. That's over, off, over mid off. Great shot from Gardner. Good man will be there. And that's. Hit her in the midriff, that always hurts. It's a full toss, that's not a good delivery. Down leg side, Perry does what she does best, punish the bad ball. Four runs. Port, the Hobart team. That's short, and that's a great shot from Perry. Real trademark type stuff from the skipper. Rock back. For the Hurricanes as well, up to the stumps. Down the wicket, and over cover. It's going to be a long, long chase. And it's four. Tossed up. It's in the air and gone. Matthew strikes. Gardner won't be pleased with that shot. She smashes her pads with her bat. A disappointing end to a good innings. 35 is all. It's a full toss. It's been high and handsome. That's six. 
That's a big six. Good shot. Side. So can't afford to be two back. And that's bold. Gone. A wicket. A step back has tried to slash that through the offside. And Matthews has struck. Runs. And that's going to be runs. It's exactly what's happened there. The last ball's gone for four. Under 16 required. Goes again and hits that better, and that's four. That's going to be two bounces and into the rope. So only the three fielders out. Goes for it and goes over mid-off. Took up the challenge, Perry, and hits it hard and long, and it's going to break the boundary. Perry, can she finish the game here? It's fallen straight. She hits it down the ground, and that's four. Perry finishes with 44, not out. And the Sydney Sixers win by seven wickets. And with 10 balls remaining, a really solid win for the Sydney Sixers. We mentioned if Perry stayed there that there was every chance the Sixers were going to get home. Uh, 106 did look a little on the light side. And the Sydney Sixers take the two points in match 25 of the Rebel WBBL second season.